Hi everyone, I'm Mary with Mary Greeley News. Thank you for joining me. Our geomagnetic field is currently being disturbed by a stream of uh, solar activity coming from a coronal hole there on the sun. On uh, NOAA, they explain about geomagnetic storms and how they affect the Earth a little bit better here. Here's a current image of the sun that NOAA is providing us. It very well could affect the weather, GPS systems, electrical power transmissions, radio communications, and satellite com communications. Here's the aurora forecast posted for today by NOAA. Uh, yeah, you might see it way up north, up there by Alaska, of course, and uh, different places on in the Arctic. Space weather, Potsdam uh, prediction for the radiation belt forecast. And I'll bring this over for you if I can. Okay. Let me make that smaller for you. And we'll bring it down. Yeah, you can see how they're going to expecting it to peak. Yeah, more radiation coming into the Earth's atmosphere. The uh, Earth's magnetic field is pretty weak right now. And we need that to protect us from things such as what's going on. Um, currently, there's no sunspots um, Earth-facing. This here is provided by Solar Ham. Yeah, you can see there's no sunspots. Um, yeah, good thing if because of the Earth's magnetic field being weakened like it is. If there was a solar flare Earth-facing, yeah, it could be devastating for the Earth. Here's another current image of the sun provided by SOHO, NASA, and another image provided by NASA. A few days ago, this is the coronal hole that was Earth-facing, uh, the reason we're now being hit by these particles from the sun. The aurora impact is being updated every few minutes. I'll give you a link to this web page and you can watch and see. If later maybe the northern states of the U.S. will be able to see um, possible auroras. You just don't know. I remember one time here in South Dakota we got to see uh, curtains of auroras. It was beautiful. It was probably about 4 o'clock in the morning when my kids were doing their paper delivery. Yeah, it was a while ago before they had cell phones. If I had a cell phone back then or if cell phones were available, I would have photographed it. It was absolutely beautiful. So that's all I have for you right now. If you have any thoughts or comments or questions, put it down below. Thank you for your support. I'm on Patreon. I'm also on BitChute, but BitChute only allows me to upload three videos a day. Um, Patreon allows me to put all the videos on there if you want to subscribe to that. And I also have a PayPal account. Thank you again. Happy Holidays. Merry Christmas. And I hope we have all um, a very happy and prosperous New Year. But the way things are going, I don't know. And I'll talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.